I hate that I'm late and I don't even know where I'm headed. I know I'm scared of this hard to communicate because no one told me this is what my 20s will feel like today. Now I'm late in a society like the one we live every day with the feeling on my chest that I don't do enough. But what's enough if I haven't even celebrated my 23rd? I don't know if it's the world against or if it's me, but some people run while I try to discover how to simply be me. How to exist, how to persist, how to keep that little girl sprite in the twist of having to manage the roller coaster called life, and I even forget that I'm alive sometimes. And it's hard to drive the wheels of my own car, and in the rush of not knowing the end line, I panic. So welcome to my rant. B20 is not even that bad, but I say it. I panic a little bit too much sometimes. I forget that I'm a miniature adult, that I pay the bills, keep the money still, that I have to go to sleep because the bills not only have numbers but also energy. Full of sleepless nights, thinking how are they supposed to be the best years of my life, and yeah, tell me I'm young, but with the irony of all, the panic years are just beginning and I'm thinking, thinking how to have it all figured out before I'm 30. And that's not smart thinking because I'm early, so please tell that for my 20s. I'm just in the beginning of a border of my life where that weapon called perfection rules my pains and becomes an infection. To stay present deep in the moment, to live life because the world expects me to fulfill all career highs. And sometimes I just want to stop thinking ahead of time. Sometimes I just don't want to even make a start because the expectations are too high. And what if I don't get it right? But again, what's right if I just turn 21? I'm allowed to mess it up every once in a while, and I tell that to myself because if I don't, well, I believe growing up is funny, and it's, it's not funny, and it's rather shocking, very strange, and it's not really stopping. It's interesting to question what I used to believe. It teaches me about the humankind. I used to believe everyone was my best friend for life, but I see the real world now, not the one that I saw from the arms of my dad with the responsibilities of up top, knowing what I want, dreaming of a bright future, even in the dark. While I run through my panic years, I must read more books, find the balance, have a perfect CV, learn finances, because a nine to five apparently has to be trapped, making ends is not the right way, meditate, singing with yourself, because if I don't, it's not enough self-love, take care of my skin, because who can't stand the people if I don't do my skincare routine? Save, invest, wake up at 5 a.m., know the trends, make plans with friends. Because if I don't socialize, I'm hurting myself. Be independent, a list of things that I have to check to be on the same page in a society that don't stop nowadays. Much of it is real, and I have a lot to do to reach everything that I just said. Sometimes thinking about it makes me want to lie down in bed and be still up. Despite of a lot of emotion in place, I remember that I am where I should be, nowhere else. I go at my own pace, but I panic because I leave my days talking, a conversation with myself about the beginning of this year. My 20s, my panicking. Thank you.